Hey, it's Ocean Sims and welcome back to my channel. We are on part two of the perfect life challenge. So in the last part, we did have Zena who was a toddler. I was playing with her as a toddler and she ended up aging up. So therefore we are playing her next stage in life. We didn't get to see this much as a toddler, but Zena loves winter sports. Her mom and dad have taken her up here before when she was really, really young and she remembers that. So, um, at least in my eyes. So she loves this right now and um, whoa, that was super fun. <laughs> Santa is feeling sad. She feels like her birthday was forgotten about, but that's only because we forgot to blow out her candles because she ended up autonomously aging up. So we will enjoy our cake when we get home. I just take Santa being sad about her birthday um, because of her dad. Her dad is actually at work. This is so crazy. So dad just called mom and goes, hey, Sachiko, I've been thinking of getting a new job. What do you think? We just argued this morning about you needing to understand there's a fine line between work and home and now you're thinking about quitting the job that you worked so hard to be at the top. Like what? Even though I don't have much say so over the parents and what they do, I think she's going to say you should follow your heart. It's whatever you decide because if you could miss your daughter's birthday over work, like don't try to get on my good side now, you know, like that really hurt her feelings. So we are just going to uh, keep enjoying um, the time with our daughter and keep having fun on these slopes. All right, looks like we wiped out on the last one here. I think we're gonna actually purchase some hot food and drink first because we're we are really, really hungry. Before we get some food, oh, what I do? Oh, let's ask for a capsule and let's take a selfie with Yamachan. Yamachan is here and I'm feeling a little bit sad, so why not? Hi. Oh, thank you. <laughs> My mom says capsules are good luck. Now this birthday just got better. So mom's right there. I'm just walking. Let me go ahead and get Zena. She's probably gonna get a Terry Mayo hot dog. Mm. Yeah, let's do it. Hey kiddo, why the long, oh my gosh. Penny, you stop calling me. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. Her thing got stuck and this is how he's gonna surprise you. So you need some help with that. She's gonna be like, dad, oh. Oh, it's still stuck. Maybe mom can shake this. She's gonna come over here. She's gonna say, so it looks like you decided to show up. Yay, she got the item. Of course, mom would get it when he's trying to save the day. I'm just gonna put it in Santa's inventory. We have to purchase a snowboard that we can use. Here we go, little kitty boards. It looks like Santa literally just like autonomously walked over here and wanted to talk to her parents. And she's like, what's going on? Like, she overhears her mom saying, what was that about asking me if you wanted a new job or not? Um, I'm ready to go snowboarding. And she's like, come on, Shohei, if you came here to show her a good time, let's let's do that and let's not talk about why you're here. Oh my goodness. I think Penny literally needs to chill out. Now I have a hurt sentiment with Sachiko. Maybe I just feel like my, my mom was being unfair to my dad because he just got here and I looked at it as a surprise and I don't really understand where my mom was coming from. So certain statements I heard her say, I was just like, why are you being mean to my dad? <laughs> he's here, he's finally here for my birthday. On a brighter note, it is definitely time to shred these little it's definitely time to uh, pretend that we are a famous snowboarder. She's having so much fun. Like, could you imagine? And I love this little snowboard with the cupcakes for her. Wow, is she gonna land it? Oh, seeing my dad on the slopes is like super duperly inspiring me to really shred it. Like, I kind of want to do this. <laughs> oh no, I think I got hurt. Got a boo-boo. Sina got a little hurt on something she was doing recently. Where's mama? Whoa. Whoa, my dad's doing flips. My hand hurts a little bit but I'm not telling anybody. I'm, I'm a big girl, I'm a big girl, okay? I gotta, I gotta do this. I got this. I got this, ooh! <laughs> oh man, I'm doing it, I'm doing it. Can I do it? Yes, I got it. Still running super fun, man, I don't know. Kinda feeling this, kinda feeling this more than the sledding on the bunny slope. <laughs> oh, except that part. Okay, I'm ready to go home now. <laughs> I can do better. Oh shucks, that was not a great snowboarding run for Zena. Even though she's just a kid, she knows she can do better. So Zena is peacefully sleeping in her bed and I noticed that Shohei is gone and it says that he is off to work, which is crazy because he just got up at one in the morning and went to work. Mom is still sleeping, but me being Zena, I did hear him leave and it uh, definitely made me feel like, you know, where is he going? Huh, I have school tomorrow. Tomorrow is same as the first big day of school and it's gonna be exciting. It's elementary school, so we have to get up super early for that. She can barely sleep. In fact, she's a little hungry. <laughs> I don't think she's gonna get any sleep tonight. I need something, I'm way too hungry. I know mom would probably kill me if I got some chips. So I'm just gonna eat some applesauce. She can't hear me, but I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm super sad. Like, why did my dad just leave like that? Like, ugh. I can't believe he's at work right now. Definitely have to clean up my bowl because I don't want mom to know that I 
had a late night snack. I think I'm going to see if Nanami is awake because that is a friend that I made and I'm going to see if she's awake and if she is feeling nervous about school too. I know it's like three in the morning but I have a laptop in my room and stuff because I'm spoiled. <laughs> I'm so sad right now. Whatever I'm doing, I'm pouring out to Nanami right now. She's like, what's wrong? I'm so nervous about the first day of school. My mom kept me home for preschool, so I've never even been in like a school environment. <laughs> I am wide awake about to just play with my beer, and I need to be nurtured, so I'm like nurturing something else. Isn't that the oxymoron of it all? This is who I need. I need my bliss. Like, this is this is who's going to make me feel better. Come over here. <laughs> it looks like bliss ran underneath mom's bed. I'm so weak. There you are. Mom is like super duper tired. I'm going to give Bliss a comforting hug and then I'm going to take a shower. Mom literally is not even awake and I just walked in here and I stink. How could she not smell me? Dad is home. I'm just going to hurry up and get in the shower really quick. I'm going to make it super quick too. Mom is like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Uh, you're back home? Where did you go? I had to work okay we literally go all out we have to make her breakfast for her first day of school and we also have to pack her, her lunch i feel a little bit privileged that i kind of want to eat school lunch and i don't want to pack my own lunch <laughs> i don't know why oh i forgot we had that semi capsule from yesterday what did we end up getting whoa yamachan gave us a madam zoe are you ready for the first day of school baby yeah i guess i'm a little excited all right Cena, here you go all done so i am waiting for everyone to get home and penny calls while shohei is at work and goes quick question sachiko yoshikawa and i were planning to spend some time together should i do it and i feel like she's being so spiteful like okay you're you're ignoring all of my calls i found out you have a wife i'm gonna say if i were you i wouldn't do that do not do that so Cena's first day of school is super important to me i do have an edge education overhaul mod by Kwai Stacy, which allows me to do some more things um and I really like it so I have her listening to the teacher which is going to increase her school performance but it will definitely reduce the fun oh it's raining I'm back home from school and today was pretty tense stressful school day no one's here and that definitely makes for a different dynamic for me this is really weird for me I'm home alone Giving my mom your rice that mom left me. This is actually making me feel kind of sad. I'm just going to be a good girl, do my homework. But if every day after school feels this lonely, then my weeks are going to suck. <laughs> uh, because she's just not used to this. She's used to having all this attention and... Or at least from her mom anyway, you know. Who gets home for Shohei or... Oh, they both get home at the same time, 5 o'clock. And I know Sachiko is probably going to rush home. Yay, they're both home. Jeez Louise. Okay. And Oh, wow. First thing he did was pay some bills when he came home. And the first thing she's doing is putting out decorations. Hey, Sina, how was your first day of school? Ooh, sorry. Mom's a little tart. She's literally helping her with her homework already. Like, literally. I love it. Mom's cooking, which kind of makes me kind of feel like I want to cook and play. <laughs> and, uh, uh, more parental talking. How was your day? How was your day? <laughs> yes, I'm a chef. So this is actually going to raise my creativity and motor. Zane is on her way to becoming a little chef, though the food may be of questionable quality. Why we can eat these? Okay, all right, easy bake oven. Let's do it. Well, I do want to eat mom's food too, though. So I want you to tell me all about your day. Everything. Don't leave a D's hell out. Oh, uh, well... Um, I do have, I did see Nanami at school. <laughs> oh, that was everything. This scene was everything. I love my mom. I just do. Today is Harvest Fest, our first holiday in the series. I swear this girl is like her dad in a lot of ways and I love it. I love how they both are just awake. So this challenge really isn't about the parents and everything, but I find it kind of ironic that Shohei actually got a promotion. So after even consulting his wife about the job, he literally got promoted. I was like, yo, this is literally like an anime. He gets promoted when he's thinking about leaving the company. It's hilarious. Dad, I think think our toilet is broken so i'm gonna have him come in here and repair that while he's washing dishes in the bathroom he might as well take care of that too i know that we're supposed to mainly be controlling Sena, and so sometimes you've seen me we control the parents but it's because if i just simply control Sena, like she will be eating grilled cheese every night you know what I'm saying? And certain things like that, that I just don't want to have that memory for her. Like, I'm not like super hyper focused on the parents. I am more hyper focused on her. There are certain things that I want my sim to remember and kind of develop 
brown, but I am hyper focused on her. Like I don't care about their jobs or what they have going on. I cheated their skills up. So they're kind of like set. Oh, Saint is sad. So she's sad because her doll is sick. Despite your best efforts, you were unable to cure the malady, malady plaguing your poor doll. <laughs> she is so empathetic. I love her. Honestly, can we go hiking? Can we please go hiking in this weather? It's so nice. It's windy. It would be lovely just walking through this hiking trail with the wind blowing in our faces. Like, oh my gosh, please, mom, please. Also, mom, um, she went ahead and decorated. Uh, it's a mixture between Harvest Fest and Winterfest because Winterfest is obviously her favorite holiday over all of them. So we do have a little tree here, courtesy of mom and some presents. Of course, they're my presents. <laughs> oh no, why is she angry? Still upset. Sometimes Santa can barely think straight when she's around a sim who caused her pain. Why is she still upset with her mom? And then we have a sentiment with dad. What is that about? Um, oh, so apparently he gave me some friendly advice. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I was telling him about a situation about kids not wanting to play with me at school. And he told me to tell the teacher. Santa remembers when Shohei listened to her problems and shared some thoughtful advice. Wow. So they remember the parenting stuff, too. That's what's up. Like sentiments is really starting to be like probably one of my favorite features. I swear this fish dinner looks so delicious, especially with some rice or something. Whoa, this looks amazing. Let's call everyone to the grand meal. Hopefully no one has anything to do. And I'm on my way, mom. Let's go get this food. Oh, I'm sitting in here. Why is she sitting in here? I want her to sit here with her parents. Oh. <laughs> we are gonna go on a hiking trip because that's what dad promised, especially after that whole birthday incident. So I'm really looking forward to it. I'm so excited to do that. Should we hike the bamboo forest? Yes, I definitely wanna go through the bamboo forest and let's go with my parents and Nanami. I'm totally gonna invite Nanami. She must be around here somewhere. We actually have hung out with her off cam and did our homework together. We are becoming great friends and oh man, not the sink being broken. Hey Nanami, I'm so excited that you could come. He's like, yeah, but um, so, so far she's only made like one friend and I kind of like that because we're starting to get kind of close with her and it's super cool because I don't know, it's just like, I can definitely see her having like that one childhood best friend stick with her for life. Dude, look how fast we're walking and I, I'm on speed one right now. This is the best Harvest Fest ever, mom. I literally love this. Are you having fun? I am, I am. You know when your parents are like, are you having fun? I am, I really am. This is great. Like we're getting fresh air. Wow, look at this. You know, finally, a day with my parents where it just feels like we're all together for once and dad's not rushing off to work. Can you believe that Shohei actually didn't rush off to work today? They're looking at her like, we're really happy that um, you're happy, Sina. We really want you to be happy, honey. So happy Harvest Fest. We're thankful for you. Um, Thank you, mom and dad. <laughs> like, why are y'all pouring your love out to me right now? Dude, we just like froze and I don't even know where Nanami is. Let's hike the scenic loop. <laughs> I'm gonna go off and hike the scenic loop with uh, Nanami because I don't know what's going on. And apparently they're both feeling flirty, a special connection. Feeling close with a sim can deepen existing romantic feelings and make Sachiko want to get even closer. <gasps> are you guys, are they feeling okay? Like, are they dazed from the food or like, <laughs> maybe being in the woods again got them feeling like, you know what, this is what, this, this is, we love each other, I don't know. <laughs> Hey, Nanami, I thought we lost you. My parents had me trapped in the forest for a second. I don't know what was going on. Finally, real hiking. Okay, are we lost? No, we're not lost. We just, girl, we just hiked this park, girl. <laughs> we just hiked this park. Hey, mom. Hey, dad. Hey, you girls made it around here fast. Yeah, thanks. All right, come on, let's go. <laughs> They're talking back here. Oh, man. I don't know. Hey, it's Mr. Nishidaki. What's up, man? He's like, hey, kids, what's up? <laughs> <laughs> just, we look like we're like annoying him. <laughs> Nanami just fits my vibe. You know, I'm all about vibes. Y'all know me. Yeah, I'm Sina. You know, like I want vibes, good vibes only. I don't want a bunch of friends. I just want, I just need one good friend that I can trust for the rest of my life and I can trust with all of my secrets, okay? That will literally bail me out of a jail cell, but also tell me that I'm stupid. Like that's gonna be this girl right here. Oh, look, look at this, Nanami. Let's do this. Let's write a wish. What do I wish? Hmm. I wonder what she wished for. What do you think? Who is, oh. yo, <laughs> this is what happens when you only know one sim in the whole world. Like, bruh, you have got to chill. She's crazy, yo. Like I'm about to get a restraining order, no lie. You wanna know something? I never got time to really like appreciate this pack because I got early access to it. So I kind of like devoted, where did Nanami go? Oh, I guess she had to go. I'll just stay here. Um, I, I had to, 
kind of like make all this content and push it out. And it was so much fun just playing Snow Escape in base game. But that kind of like made it so I was kind of like already exhausted of what the pack could do. And coming back to it this way is like really, really cool. I'm gonna change into my pajamas and I want mom to read me a book because that's like part of my aspiration. Sena actually is the owner of the full collection of Henry Puffer. Okay, this is actually custom content um, from a Henry Puffer, like a fan made custom content pack. And I am going to have mom read that to me. She's reading to me, yay. I wish, really wish she would have read to me like in my room or something, but it's okay. <laughs> it is the next morning and look who's meditating me <laughs> i am full-blown meditating getting in my zen before i go to school and because uh school is almost over and she wants to watch some civil public access which i'm gonna have her do because we do need to complete some of our whims i think we need to at least complete 20 and now our kodatsu table is <laughs> broken i find it interesting that dad wants to embrace mom and be funny with her i'm hitting it just because i'm just out of habit but yeah. it's crazy that things seem fine. News flash today is Friday and on Monday, Sana ages up. I may even age her up on Sunday because Monday they had to go to school and that would kind of stink, right? Like having to do that on a school day, but who knows? Um, I just want it to be a really good party. So I don't know if I can do that if she has to go to school, but hey, looks like the repair person is here. Hi, thank you, yes. <laughs> she keeps changing into her everyday outfit and what's making me mad is that if you live in Mount Kamarabi, you're supposed to be wearing a school uniform. So I just put the school uniform as one of her outfits to wear because I'll just manually do it myself, you know? So I guess they took that out or something or it's glitching, but I realized that like, <laughs> not too long ago. Back home from school and I am cleaning the kitty litter and I actually think I want to invite over Nanami so that we can do some homework together because one of my whims is to finish my homework, which is always like that every day. I always just want to finish my homework because I just want to get it out of the way and I want to have good grades and I want to have a good career in life and I was raised right, I have a B and I really need an A. <laughs> not gonna lie, I thought I would feel kind of lonely when my parents are like still gone at work when I get out of school, but I kind of like it now that I'm friends with Nanami and I feel like, you know, I just kind of have someone to hang out with. <laughs> hey Nanami, let's take a picture in our uniforms because uh, we look cute and, and I'm finally wearing my uniform, so. <laughs> Dang, why is the picture so close up like this? There we go, that's much better. Okay, I did it again and this looks way better. Minami, my birthday is on Monday. What do you think I should do? Like, how do you think my birthday should go? I actually think I'm gonna age her up Sunday. Whoa, our relationship is like fully up with Minami. Can we become best friends? Yes, we can finally become best friends forever. Yes, we need to become best friends forever. Yay, so mom is home, but dad isn't home. I actually had him working overtime just because <laughs> something different than the usual, you know. Um, because he didn't work on yay we're best friends forever he didn't work on harvest fest so i feel like he'd want to make up for it oh wow wait the festival of lights has started <gasps> mom 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 can we go can we go please 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 please, please, please. definitely gotta get some food from here i want the mm, i don't know i don't know what i want oh i'm gonna be basic strawberry taiyaki mm, this looks so yummy. This is fun and I'm not afraid to admit it. If it's Penny, guys, I'm gonna scream. <laughs> I hate you. I hate you. <laughs> You're literally a homewrecker. Like, I will literally put you on blast and put you on social media and say how much of a homewrecker you are. I keep the receipts, okay, Penny? Like, you need to stop. Thank you so much, Yamachan, for me. Not that I feel obligated, but hey, you're part of my childhood. Like, I swear. <laughs> I'm about to turn into a teenager like in a couple days, but I swear I'm gonna always love you, Yamachan. Okay, <laughs> boom. <laughs> so pretty. I love it here so much. I want to make a wish with my mom. You guys already know. It's been a little rough, but I love her so much and she's here at the festival with me. Mom, let's go here and make a wish together. Made a special wish. The stars are shining a little brighter because Dana shared a wish with a special sim. I really want to take a picture of my mom. She looks so gorgeous and the stars are just shining. And I don't know. Honestly, I'm going to get another... Uh, <laughs> I'm getting another one of these. I'm gonna get a, a matcha flavored one. This was the best. I literally could have had my birthday here and I would have been so happy. That is so cool. Today is Dana's birthday. She's originally supposed to be aging up on Monday, but today is Sunday in the Sims game. And I just don't want to wait on the school day to age her up because I want the whole day to be about uh, her. Dana wanted a spa day themed birthday, which I felt like was so adorable. I need to make sure that for her athletic outfit, she has um, this right here. Yeah. 
this, the same one that's matching her mom's because her mom has the same exact one. <laughs> and I think that'd be really, really cute. It's still the morning time and I really want her to do some volunteering with her mom. Right now her empathy is right here and I feel like we can get that up just a little bit more. So her and her mom, like dad doesn't feel like doing all of this stuff right now. I'm gonna have them volunteer since it doesn't take too long. And then we can go ahead and head over to the spa and have like a nice little day. I'm gonna do the bake sale again because I really like the bake sale. What? The Festival of Youth is here? No way, the Festival of Youth. This is the festival I wanted to go to. We may have to end this early. After we get this chance card, we may have to, we may have to end this like really early. Oh man, okay. Let's see how long this is going to last. Um, the number of Sims showing up to the bake sale are pretty dismal. If it doesn't improve soon, the charity won't raise any money. Santa needs to come up with a good idea fast. Bring out the glasses of milk. Pronto. Post baked goods to Simstagram. I think we're going to like use social media to kind of boost this up. It looks like Santa overestimated her social presence. Her posts only get two likes and no shares. Oh man, the bake sale director scolds Santa for playing on her phone instead of working the bake sale. Well, that's really mean. I've done that before and it's worked, so... Okay, this backfired. I'm leaving. I don't care. <laughs> wow, it's such a beautiful sunny snow day. This is the perfect, perfect thing ever. Oh, I'm so excited. Definitely want to come here and order some food. That's the first thing that Santa does. She loves the food. We have to get an ice cream crepe. Um, I think I'm definitely going to go for, you already know, strawberry. Mm, this looks so yummy. I love this so much. <laughs> I love this. Oh, man, this is good. <laughs> I totally forgot Yamachan is here and we can go on a void critter hunt, which would be really cool. And hey, that's a new kid. I can be friends with I can age them up when I age up today and like I make sure that everyone's like the same age as me but at least I can create some friends and I can probably make them over on my own time it's like hey I've never seen you around before I know I'm kind of like low-key <laughs> not gonna lie I'm a little low-key around here but it's nice to meet you guys I'm not even worried about like the science tables or creativity table as far as skill she's doing really well her mental skill is literally so high because we played so many games of chess off cam with Shohei she's had a seven level seven mental skill it's amazing um and she also has level two knitting. I forgot to tell you guys, we um did some knitting. Yeah, we found another one. Awesome. Uh, with mom. So I'm really proud of her skills. Uh, being that I am playing this as a challenge on the channel, if I was playing this off cam, I would have this age setting probably on long and I'd really be immersing myself in this. I am gonna do this off cam and just kind of like play. It's more of a way to play the game rather than a challenge. So that's why it's something that um, I'm kind of like, rushing a little bit if you if you notice so if you see anything where you're like ah you're not doing this or that it's like ah this is still a series on youtube so i have to kind of like you know be mindful of that i wonder where all of them are because like we need 10 that's a lot yes i found another one. Oh, come on it's 302 mom's gonna come get me oh man dang it i swear i have yet to get this void critter challenge like have yet to do this so Oh, it kind of stinks. Purchase paper. Oh, purchase and wear paper kabuto. Man, I totally miss this. You guys, for the longest time, I was like, where do we, where do I get this from? And whole time, it's right here. Wow. Oh, nice. I love this. Oh, cool. Look at that. Wow. And let's get a semi capsule too. All right. So we got like two semi capsules here because I'm addicted. And then now we have to. Yes, give blessing of youth. It's important for an adult to give the blessing of youth. So I definitely have to go ahead and um, as her mom, give her that. Like Sachiko would not miss that up. So I have to make sure I give her that blessing of youth. Yes, there we go. Give blessing of youth. You are gonna have a wonderful childhood, baby girl. I love you so, so, so much. And that cures any type of hurt she has ever had with her mom this whole episode. I have to take a picture of Zena in her little Kabuto hat. It's so adorable. Oh. I'm gonna cry, dude. This kid is so freaking adorable. At five o'clock, we're gonna go because I don't want it to get like too dark when we go to the spa. And I do want to get her aged up. She can make that a goal for her future children if she was to decide to have some. Ignore this right here, please. I have custom content, so we're just gonna go this way. But the lovely thing is that she now has a sentiment with her mom that says, I mean, even with the hiking, with the festival of light making a wish together it says fun at the festival of youth so we'll always treasure this memory and i wish they would stay forever but let's go ahead and take the girls to the spa what we can do is definitely get our uh, some facial mask so i am going to get facial mask let's purchase one let's do a hydrating Ooh, relaxing no let's do relaxing and then the animal facial mask for our daughter okay cool so let us 
give this to our daughter and then let's put this on yay look at our mask it's so cute oh so Zena loves one of the gifts that her mom just gave her which was a Timmy the turtle a pink one and um, she's also gonna give her the other gift that she made for her um, you know it is her birthday after all and I didn't set it as a birthday birthday because I already check that off with a list of the things to do and when she turns 18 that's when i'm gonna like really plan it and actually complete the goals of having a birthday party but i just wanted this to be very relaxed so you know birthday party gifts and everything i'm gonna open the semi capsules that i got from the festival and oh i finally got a new one okay cool so what's this one oh medieval grand whoa <laughs> look at all the snow angels <laughs> It's like what happened here. I swear I did not do yoga enough with Sena. <laughs> I love that kids can do yoga now And that was like one of the things that I didn't really do a lot of with her But I love this um, at least she got to do it a little bit and then you know when she turns into a teen She'll do some more, but let's go ahead and end the part. Let's have her age up here and blow out her candles <laughs> yay it's her birthday she needs to come over here and she is going to blow out her candles this has been a crazy episode i've loved every single second of it and i cannot wait to play the teenage life stage with you guys but let's see who she will be i kind of want her aspiration to be like going to university and going to college and stuff i feel like that's something she would definitely really 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 want to do or wellness i just feel like she definitely would want to be really 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 zen you know and i'm definitely not playing college in this little series i'm just not like that's just we're not gonna we're not gonna be able to make it if i was doing a longer series you probably would but i think she just wants to achieve um inner peace especially just like what kid wants a zen spa themed birthday you know i definitely think unintentionally she'd probably be a little bit self-absorbed in the way where she kind of like craves that attention because she's always had attention growing up so it's like of course um and she's always had that validation piece from her mom constantly saying good job and things like that so i always like to give my sims two good traits and one bad and that's kind of like her semi bad trait so the next trait she has will probably be something more positive like family oriented or outgoing so if you enjoyed this please don't forget to like comment and subscribe just keep simming always 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 stay wavy and i will see you guys in the next episode peace out